Recently, our class has been learning about copyright and creative commons licenses. Let's take a look at the CC0 or public domain license. When you're looking for any work and there is a CC0 by it, that means it's in the public domain. Whenever a person makes something, then the rights of that work and how the work is used or shared by a limited time. That right is protected by law. That's what copyright means. Anything in the public domain is not subject to copyright. You can use it without breaking any laws. If, however, you find a work and there is no license visible, you should assume that it has all rights reserved. Which means you cannot use the work without first asking for permission from the creator. That means with a public domain work, there are a lot of things that you can do. Unlike the attribution share like CC license, you can change a public domain work and share with whatever license you choose. Also, you don't have to attribute who made the original public domain work. Another thing you can do with public domain works is you can add on, remix, or tweak them, unlike the no derivatives CC license. You can also take a public domain work and use it to make money unlike the non-commercial CC license. Public domain, as you can see, is the least restrictive license. Next, we'll look at the attribution license. It's a little more restrictive, but it still allows you a lot of freedom when licensing a work. Attribution is a great license if you made a work and you want a little credit. You mean like a Visa or a MasterCard? No! Attribution means that the only thing you have to do is attribute or credit who made a work. You can remix attribution works and you can sell them. Unlike the share alike license, attribution allows you to share your creation however you choose. The next more restrictive license out of the seven is... Attribution share alike. Because of the BY, you would have to attribute or credit who originally made it. And because of the SA, you would have to share a creation with the same license that was shared with you. With this license, you can remix and tweak a work. And unlike the BY and C license, you can sell a creation using a BYSA license. So, what's next? Hmm, I think it's time we take a look at the attribution no derivatives license. Let's get started. Attribution no derivatives has a few restrictions. With this license, you have to attribute the original creator and you can't change the original work. That means you are not able to remix, tweak, or build upon it. There are many things that you can do with this license. For example, you can use it commercially and non-commercially. You can change the license of the work, unlike the attribution share-like license. If you want a little more control over your work, you might want to check out the attribution non-commercial license. So, how does this license give you more control? With attribution non-commercial, people who want to use your work have to attribute you, the original creator. And if people want to use your material, they can only use it for non-commercial purposes. That means whatever you use the work for, you cannot make money off of it. Some things this license allows you to do is remix, tweak, build upon, or change a work in any way imaginable, unlike the no derivatives license. A person also does not share it under the same terms they found it, unlike the share alike license. And now for something completely different. To share alike or not to share alike? That is the question. Okay, enough Shakespeare. Let's get down to business. Attribution, non-commercial, share alike. There are some things you have to do with this license. Attribution means credit the original creator of a work you use. Unlike no derivatives, you can remix or tweak it, but non-commercial means you can't sell a work for money. And the share alike part means you have to share your creation under the same terms of the original work. Last but not least, the most restricted license of all, of all goes to... Attribution, non-commercial, no derivatives! Thank you, thank you so much. I'd like to thank my teacher for teaching me about Creative Commons licenses. I'd like to thank my teammates, Miss Susser, for giving us this challenge to educate you all. I'd like to thank. Okay, okay, enough. We don't have all day. Just get to the license. Fine. <laughs> Attribution, not commercial, no derivatives. Wow. That's a mouthful. There are some things that you have to do with this license. You have to attribute the creator. You also can't sell a piece of work using this license. You cannot make a derivative work from it. Unlike the share alike license, you can change the way you share your work, or you could just leave it the way you got it. Thank you for joining us. Good night, everyone.